video, I'll go through a few examples of sketching the graph of a line that's given in point-slope form. In the first example, we want to graph the line y equals negative two-thirds times the quantity x minus four plus one. This is in the form y equals m times x minus x1 plus y1. m represents the slope and x1 comma y1 is a point on the graph. So in this case, the slope of this line is negative two-thirds. And we know that there is a point on the line four comma one. When x is four, the y value will be one. So to plot this graph, I will first plot the point that I know is on the graph. And in this case, we know that the point four comma one is on the graph. So I go over to four up to one and I plot that point. And then I travel the slope to the next point that we know is on the graph. So the slope of this line is negative two thirds. So that is change in y divided by change in x. So the change in x is three, the change in y is negative two. So every time we go over on the x values by three, when we increase the x by three, we will go down on the y values by two. So I start at the point I know that's on the graph, four comma one. I go over one, two, three, and I go down one, two, and I plot another point, over three, down two, and I can do it again, over one, two, three, down one, two, plot another point on the graph. So here is a sketch of the line y equals negative two-thirds times the quantity x minus four plus one. Let's sketch the graph of the line y equals four times the quantity x plus five minus seven. Again, I see that this is in point slope form. Here I see the slope is four, and I'm noticing here when it says x plus five, that means negative five will be the x value of the point, and it says negative seven here, meaning negative seven is the y value of the point. So negative five comma negative seven is a point on the line. That's the first point I'll plot. Back five, down seven. There's a point on the line. I then travel the slope. The slope is four. I write it as a fraction, four over one. Compare it to the definition, change in y over change in x. So we increase the x by one every time we increase the y by four. So we go over one on the x and up four on the y. So I put my cursor on the point negative five, negative seven. I go over one, up four. And I plot another point. So here is a sketch of the line y equals four times the quantity x plus five minus seven. I want to graph the line y equals negative two times the quantity x plus six minus four. In this case, I see the slope is negative two and it passes through the point negative six comma negative four. So I plot the point negative six, negative four Since the slope is negative two, I can think of that as a fraction, negative two over one. Compare it to the definition, which is telling me we go over one as we go down two. So I put my cursor on the point, negative six, negative four. I go over one, down two, and plot another point. So there is a sketch of the line, y equals negative two times the quantity x plus six minus four.